Hey guys, welcome to the Flying Busters channel. This is episode 4 of Modern Warfare 3 Mythbusters. I hope you guys enjoy it and I hope you guys can take away a few things from this episode. So our first myth is if a Stinger Missile can lock on to a Juggernaut. So we're going to get a Juggernaut and point a Stinger Missile at him and see if it locks on so we can fire at him. Uh, so when we got this myth, we tried it. We aimed the Stinger Missile at the Juggernaut. Unfortunately, uh, we weren't able to fire it. So we got a, a suggestion from Mr. Basmic saying that if we use Recon Pro, maybe this will work. So uh, we tried using a few flashbangs and... Um, Unfortunately, we got the same result. We weren't able to lock on to the Juggernaut, and uh, we couldn't fire our missile. So we're going to call this myth busted. However, because we did want an explosion, we got a small and fired it, and we were able to blow up the Juggernaut. So our next myth is if killstreaks can work after an EMP. This is killstreaks like the IMS. So first of all, you deploy the IMS, pick it up, EMP goes off, put it back down, see if it still works. Uh, so anyway, uh, we're going to have both perspectives here. As you can see, is deploying his IMS and picking it back up and uh, just moving it, as you can see. And uh, it has to be in this state. When you call in the EMP and when you deploy it, uh, it, it still works, apparently. And we're going to get like a little third person shot right here. Uh, we're going to try the same thing with the sentry gun, see if that works. So we, we called in our EMP while it's still mobile. And uh, uh, what do you know, it still works after the EMP went off. Uh, the thing is that apparently for this to work, you need to deploy it and then pick it up while the EMP is active. Now we tried this with a assault drone, however when we tried to uh, deploy it, it blew up right in our faces. <laughs> Unfortunately. Fortunately, it didn't kill anyone. That's a good thing. Um, but as you can see, the EMP is going off in the background. Uh, we're going to try this with a, a remote sentry. And again, we are moving it and uh, deploying it. And we're trying to see if it will work. However, what, what happens, instead of actually working, you can pull out the laptop, but you can't actually use it. So, uh, as you can see, technically it is active, but the sentry gun is uh, unusable. So our, our final kill streak that we're going to test is the SAM turret. And uh, he, our guy, he can deploy, as you can see it is active, but we want to know, can it shoot down something while the EMP is still going on? So uh, what I'm going to do here is uh, get enough kills for a UAV, we're going to call it. And as you can see, the red tracking laser, the missiles fired from the SAM turret, and what do you know? It can destroy aircraft while an EMP is active. So as we can see from our results page, the IMS worked, sentry gun worked, assault drone didn't, uh, remote didn't, and the SAM turret did. So overall, we're going to call this confirmed, aside from the assault drone and the remote sentry. So our like, community myth right here is if you can stack ballistic vests and make a barrier out of them. So we're going to take three ballistic vests and see if we'll stop a bullet from a pistol. Uh, so we, st uh, as you can see, we were able to stack the vests. However, um, the vest did not stop a bullet going through them and it, it killed my buddy on the other side. Uh, and as you can see, you can clearly walk through them so they do not cause a barrier. So uh, officially we're going to call this myth busted. So this last part wasn't exactly a myth, but we want to see what would happen if you took a recon drone and put it on top of a SAM turret. As you can see there was a mighty explosion. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you'll be able to use some of these tips and I really hope it was very informative. I'll see you guys next time and thanks for watching.